Hey guys, today I'm going to teach you how to make an ISO image. An ISO image is an image of a game that you can play on a emulator. You can make this image by um, inserting a, a disc of a game that you have into your computer and using the program provided. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to hop in a game. For this example, well, this tutorial, I'm going to use Kingdom Hearts 1, since I already have a nice image of Kingdom Hearts 2 on here. So I'm going to pop that in. Alright, now what you're going to do is you're going to, you're going to download this program called Magic ISO. There is a free version on the web somewhere. I'll provide a link. So you open it up, and this is the screen you will see once you open it up. Alright. To make the ISO image, you go to... You go to Tools, Make ISO from CD slash DVD ROM. You choose the drive that you're going to get it, you're going to make it from. In my case, it's the D drive. Output file is going to be where you're going to save it to. So I'm going to save it as Kingdom Hearts. Now, instead of a UIF, you want to save it as an ISO. So select ISO. Press OK. And it will start making the ISO image. It might take a while depending on how big the game is and how fast your computer is. How, it also matters how fast your um, CD-ROM drive is as well. I won't be able to make any um, videos of me playing the bass guitar or just messing around because my camera is broken. However, I can make some random videos with some editing skill. I want to thank everybody for commenting my Copper Cab video. If you guys didn't realize it, I was just messing around. But, um, now the comments are appreciated. Yes, even the flaming comments. I love the flaming comments. No. Hee <laughs> hee! Obviously taking a long time, but that's okay. Thirty percent. I know it's thirty percent. Shut up. You don't have to tell me anything. Oh yeah, I'm using Camtasia Studio. If anybody is wondering. I used to have Hypercam, but Hypercam fails. It doesn't give me the quality I want. Yeah, it's almost 50%. Hear my CD drive running like a bitch. It likes to. Also, if you are playing any emulators, then it's important that you buy a Logic Tech controller if you really want to get that gaming experience and you're lazy enough to not get a PlayStation 1 or N64 or Genesis, whatever. Okay, this is almost done here. As you can see on the side of my desktop, it's showing that the image is made, but there's no device in it because it's not done, obviously. Now, ISO images are usually 
only made for like PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2 games. I think there are other images for Sega Dreamcast and stuff, but I don't really play Dreamcast. I might. I might. Okay. So now it's done. And you can see I have the Kingdom Hearts image. Along with my Kingdom Hearts 2 image. Okay, so that is the basics. I will provide the links in the description, and uh, yeah, have fun. Later.